How's it going everyone? So in this video, we will be doing an ab workout. So make sure you guys do follow along with me at home. Before I get started, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I do appreciate the support, it helps my channel grow. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna do the ab workout and then we are going to take one minute rest periods. Um, we're gonna be doing 10 repetitions, so that'll give us 100 repetitions when the video is done. So let's get started the exercise that I am choosing. There's our fitness workout dog right there. And a lot of you people um, have been saying, a lot of you guys have been saying that she's a camera, I won't say that word, but she's a camera, um, how do I say it? I don't know. She likes to be on camera a lot. Let's get started with the exercise. So the exercise that we are doing today is going to be Russian ab twists. So what we're going to do is we're going to get on the ground. We're going to have our legs up. Our legs have to be up. Our feet have to be up off the ground. They can't be like this. They have to be off the ground like this. Then we're going to twist. Two, three, four, sorry. One, two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Just like that. Remember, feet have to be off the ground for this exercise to count. We will be taking one minute rest periods. So starting right now, one minute rest periods, and then we will do the exercise again. I'm super, super pumped because um, I did my schooling today. So I've been putting it off for three weeks I'm done in three weeks today. I freaking killed it. Absolutely destroyed it. I had 32 transcriptions to do, which can take between two to three days sometimes. I did 19 or 20 transcriptions out of the 32. So I just killed it today. Tomorrow, because it's already making this video, it's like 11.30 at night. Um, yeah, 11.30 at night, um, making this video, so no more time left to do schooling. I got up first thing in the morning, I did schooling, then I had some stuff to do, some personal stuff during the day, just got home. I left at noon, I did my schooling in the morning till noon, and then from noon to 11.30, I had stuff to do during the day that I couldn't do my schooling or YouTube, so I'm making the video right now. That's dedication, my friends. Okay, let's do it again. So feet off the ground, one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Just like that. This will get you six pack abs, trust me. It really hurts. Um, it doesn't hurt, but it really puts a ton of pressure on the obliques and it will give you six pack abs as well. I'm also super pumped too because I have been. I have been keto lately. I've been eating a keto diet, and tomorrow I am getting pickled eggs. So I am. I, that's everyone keeps saying I'm super weird about that, but I'm super excited to get them. I love eating hard-boiled eggs, but to actually make them, to crack them, I'm super lazy. So much shit going on. I mean, it's just an excuse, but I am pretty lazy. Um, and I don't like. I don't mind boiling them, but sitting there and cracking each one when I eat like four a day, and I make 28 sitting there and cracking 28 for the week. That takes me like an hour longer to do, so I hate doing that. So I'm super excited. I just buy them in a case, or buy them in a jar, I take them out, I eat them, done. Okay, let's do it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Just like that, super simple. Again, um, we're gonna be doing 100 repetitions when this is all said and done. People um, may think, oh, the exercise is super easy. We're taking one minute rest periods. A breeze, absolutely not. My abs are already getting sore. My obliques are getting sore. This is a tough workout. So you guys have to make sure you're taking those rest periods. A lot of people think that, oh, I can go 10 to 15 minutes straight, no rest periods. You cannot do that. You'll absolutely gas out, you'll burn out. And even if you can do it for 15 minutes, 
you're not doing your body any good because you're just destroying it. Stop. So it's really good to take the rest periods. Let's go. We'll do it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. What you can also do with these is you can hold the medicine ball or you can hold the dumbbell or a plate and do your twist too. That will make it a little bit harder. And the reason why I'm making this video too is I had a subscriber probably for a month already kept asking me to make a video with Russian ab twist. So that's what this is, Russian ab twist. So my subscriber that asked me to do this, I'm making this video because of you. So yeah, if any other one of you guys have any other exercises you want me to do, just comment. Again, I read all the comments. I just don't answer all of them because I get like 100 a day. To actually type out 100 would be super hard. I used to do that for a long time. I would answer all the comments and it just got way too hard. It took like an hour a day or two hours a day just to answer the comments. So it took super long. Let's do it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Whew! Abs are on fire, my friends. We still have um, three more sets, I believe. It's gonna be tough, trust me. And if you watch a lot of other workout videos, you will see that even them, what they will do is they will have 20 second, 30 second rest periods. Watch any workout and you'll see people taking the rest periods or what they might do is they might just cut out or edit the parts where they're not working out and kind of fool you on it and just say that it's a constant workout, but what they're doing is actually taking rest periods. So you look at all the big fitness channels, what they'll do when they do their workout is usually they will have rest periods as well. It's because you need that rest. Once you do a hard set, take a rest, do 30 seconds, a minute, and then continue on. So we'll do it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So again, my feet off the ground, this puts all the pressure on my abs. But yeah, I'm super excited. I have been going keto and I've dropped quite a few pounds, but um, getting all these new uh, foods added to my diet makes it super easy. What I've been eating lately is cheese sticks. Cheese sticks are amazing. Loaded with protein, calcium, you got your fat too. Um, I've been eating lots of protein, uh, steak, chicken, um, what else? lots of uh, peanuts, almonds, stuff like that. I will be buying tomorrow on top of all that, I'll be add, adding avocados and pickled eggs. Super excited about that. I'm gonna have the almond, or gonna have the avocado in the morning. I'm gonna have the pickled eggs at night and for a snack as well. Let's get started. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Really make sure you're twisting your body when you do this. For me, I'm not really someone to sit down and eat a whole meal. I will sometimes, but what I like to do is I like to snack throughout the day and just eat every couple hours, every three hours and not really have a huge meal. Just have maybe two, 300, 400 calories here and there. So that's why I'm super excited about getting these foods and just adding them to my diet. You may be like that. You may not wanna sit down for three whole meals and have big meals. You may just like to snack throughout the day. So that's what I like to do. And um, I am trying to drop weight because I have bulked up and now I'm trying to, to drop the weight and it has been going pretty good. Again, once I'm at my, uh, my weight, my weight goal, then I will show you guys. But until then, I kind of keep it covered because I want the final product to be uh, the best it is. I want to get more shredded than I was before. So we'll do it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Really make sure you're twisting your body when you do this. You have to do the twisting motion. If you're not doing the twisting motion, then it's completely pointless, my friends. It's completely pointless. So yeah, that is the end of the video, my friends. Hopefully you guys did enjoy it. Like the video, share it. Another thing too is make sure you're doing the workouts. You have got to be doing the workouts. You have to be following me to see the results. That's what I recommend. Another thing, I know I already said this, but make sure you share the video. I'm trying to get my next goal, 250,000 subscribers. 
but then a million. My overall goal is 1 million subscribers. Just keep sharing the videos, you guys. I think last month I had 4,000 shares. Really appreciate that. Every month I just try to keep getting more and more shares. A lot of people are like, wow, you're a super underrated fitness channel. You should have way more subscribers. So really appreciate all those comments and eventually we'll get to that high subscriber mark. Right now I'm averaging about 13, 11 to 13,000 new subscribers each month. So my channel is just completely growing like this. Um, not too long ago, a couple months ago, I had 100,000 subscribers. Now I'm almost at 130,000. So props to you guys. Keep watching the videos. Keep commenting below. Let me know what I can do better. Right now, I think I hit the sweet spot by making the videos 10 minutes long, taking the one minute rest periods, and constantly switching up the exercises, doing the ab exercises, because I know you guys really enjoy doing ab exercises. And I think those are the funnest to do too. Chest is pretty fun. Back's fun, legs are fun, abs by far the most funnest to do. So those are the videos I'm gonna keep making. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Like the video, share it. Peace out.